Get your special discount offer on the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com slash video. You can set up special rules that can move or delete just junk or adult email. They are basically a specialized type of mailbox rule. You simply set up these rules in a different place than you normally create email rules. Also, while using this feature can assist you in reducing the amount of spam that you get, it cannot offer 100% protection from every single piece of spam in existence. But to set how Outlook handles junk and adult email, open the mailbox folder to which you wish to apply a junk or adult filter, and then just select tools from the menu bar and organize. The organize section will display above your mailbox folder's contents. Click the junk mail link in the lower left corner of the organize section and you'll see two bullet points appear to the right in the organize section. Use the drop downs available for each bulleted point to set up the handling of both types of unwanted mail. So for instance, new junk messages will be moved to deleted items. I can either move them or color them. And if I'm going to move them, I could choose a special folder, or I could just send them right to deleted items. And then you have to click Turn On to turn on and set the rule. And you can do the same thing with adult content. You can either color them or move them. And then click Turn On. Note that if you want to turn them off for some reason, when you come back they will be set and you have to click Turn Off before you can change what they do and then click Turn On to turn them back on. If you need more filtering power, you can click the Click Here link in the sentence below the two bullet points to switch the Organize screen. Here you can see four bullet points. The first point shows how you add senders to the junk or adult email senders list. You can actually right click on anyone in your mailbox and select Junk Email Add to Junk or Adult Content Senders Lists. And then in the future, all email from that address would be blocked. However, to view or edit the names you've added, you could click the Edit Junk Senders or Edit Adult Content Senders links in the second bullet point. That would show you the names of anyone in here, and you could click on them to delete them or edit them. You could also add names by just clicking Add and typing in the email alias or domain of the sender to be added. You can also improve your filters by downloading updates from the Outlook website, which if you click that link connects you to that site. And you can click back to junk email to return back to the original two bullet points. When you're finished, just click the little X in the upper right corner of the Organize window or select Tools and Organize again to toggle this pane back off. Like what you see? Get your special discount offer on the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com slash video. Over two dozen titles are available in Microsoft Office, QuickBooks, Photoshop, and much more.